Hi, David Hall with the weekly gold and silver coin report. It's Monday, August 19th, 2013. Doing it on Monday because we were in Chicago for the biggest coin show of the year last week. Uh, so first the medals. Uh, gold closed uh, today, uh, 1365.50. It's up about um, about sixty dollars from a week ago. Silver at um, uh, closed today at uh, right about twenty three dollars, and that's up about two and a half dollars from a week ago. Uh, platinum at uh, fifteen twelve fifty, up about thirteen bucks. So in terms of the bullion coins, no problem uh, with the gold coins uh, if you want to buy eagles or maple leaves. We like the $20 uh, St. Gaudens and $20 Liberties. I made an interesting statement. Uh, I gave a seminar at the Big Coin Show this uh, past week and I said for everybody who's interested in in bullion coins think about this uh, first $20 gold piece was 1850 the $20 St. Gaudens uh, which was made 1907 to 1933 and the $20 Liberty have been international bullion coins since the day they were minted and they still are today. A great coin, uh, small numismatic premium, very small actually historically, about as small as it's ever been in the past 27 years. The, uh, they're, they're great to buy just the raw ones, ungraded, uh, as a bullion uh, coin. If you like the graded ones, the MS62, 63, 64, 65, very small premiums and relatively good availability at the moment. Silver coins, a little bit different story. <clears throat> the premiums on silver eagles uh, are relatively high at, at this point compared to what, what they have been. Uh, there is currently no weight on limited quantities. If you wanted to make a humongous order, you might get out into the like uh, first week in September. But for now, uh, I could say that it's limited quantities, so the premiums are a little bit pricey. 90% silver bags pre-1965, dimes and quarters, U.S. dimes and quarters, very sketchy on the availability and premiums are up. Silver dollars, the old ones, 1878 to 1935, still good availability and because of that and the premiums are coin of choice at the moment for silver. In terms of rare coins, the big coin show, week-long coin show was an incredibly uh, active uh, and, and very bullish for coins. With the uh, two major auctions and all of the action from the thousand or so dealers that were there, probably over a hundred million dollars worth of rare coins sold. What's doing good? PCGS graded rare coins. Not necessarily the most expensive ones, although ultra rarities are doing fantastic and an 1804 silver dollar sold about a week ago for 3.8 million dollars. So ultra rarities are doing fantastic. Uh, also the mid-rarity kind of coins and just the, the great coins in in most grades, a PCGS grading being very important, but literally uh, copper, nickel, gold and silver, the great rare coins are doing fantastic right now. It was an amazing show. Many dealers told me it was their best show ever. So the coin market is quite warm at present and uh, bullion's looking up, uh, silver's looking particularly strong, so it's a great time to be involved. Give us a call, have fun with your coins, and as always, buy gold.